A great Zen master used to live in Tokyo. He was now old and he used to taught Zen Buddhism in his hermitage. A young warrior who had never been defeated in battle thought that if I provoke the master to fight and defeat him in the battle, my fame would spread even more. And with this thought, he reached the hermitage one day. Where is that master? If you have the courage, then come forward and face me. The angry voice of the warrior started echoing in the whole hermitage. Soon, all disciples gathered there, and finally, the master also came there. On seeing him, the warrior started humiliating him. He was abusing as many as he can to the Zen master as he could. But the master still remained silent and stood there calmly. Even after insulting for a long time, when the master did not say anything, the warrior started to panic. He did not thought that even after hearing all this, the Zen master would not say anything to him. He continued to abuse and now he abused the ancestors of the master. But it was as if the master had become deaf. He stood there with the same calmness and finally the warrior got tired and left the hermitage. After he left, the disciples got angry with the Zen master and asked the master, How can you be so coward? Why didn't you punish that rascal? If you were worried about the power of the fighter, you would have ordered us to fight with him. The master smiled and said, If someone comes to you with some stuff and you don't take it, what happens to that stuff? He stays with the one who brought him, replied a disciple. The same applies to envy, anger and resentment, said the master. When they are not accepted, they remain with the one who brought them. In this story, the master told that if you quarrel or argue with a jealous person, then only your peace will be disturbed. Nothing will happen to that person. If you support him, he will dominate you. If you don't, he will become weak and will go away defeated.